This is an AI running locally on my Android phone. And today we'll set up this with Termux and not only CLI but with GUI. So to set this up, we need to install a Linux distro. For that, we'll install Proot distro, then install Debian. You can use other distro if you want. Now log into it. A quick update. And we'll go to ulama.com. Click on download. We are on Linux. And copy this command. Back to Termux and paste it. Hit enter and it's installed and now if we execute ulama-h here are the available commands and if we try to use it like listing the available models it won't work as we have not started the server yet so to do that execute ulama serve this to start the server and here we have the url so if you go to the browser and go to localhost and this port and if you see this you are good to go now get back to termux create a new session log into debian and now if we do ulama list it's working but we don't have any models yet so let's install one ulama pull and we'll install this model this is a very base AI model with just of 700 MB. And by the way, you can head over to this page to see the available models. Link will be in description. Here we have lots of AI models which you can use. But make sure to note this as it depends on your device performance. We'll get into it later in the video. As now the model is installed. Here we have that. So let's make it running. And that's it. We can start the interview now. And this is just beginning. Later in the video, we have GUI, AI based projects, and more. So let's quickly set up GUI. And you can just say slash buy to exit out of it. And for GUI, we have a lot of options. For Android devices, I like this one. This is an open source app specifically made for this and works pretty nice. And it's available on AppDroid. So we'll get it from there. And now we need to connect it with our Olama server running locally. So from here, select Olama and allow the permissions as it uses this permission to scan the servers running and it should automatically detect the server running if it won't then click on this icon parameters and here in url we need to add the url of our ulama server which is our localhost colon 11434 and click on this refresh icon then just go back after few moments it should be there and here you will be able to see the installed models. Select one you want to use. And that's it. Also as this model is very basic, it's not so good. Let's try another one. This is a 2 GB model. And remember, the more larger model you use, the more resources it will use. So depending on your device, you can use that. For mine, I have 6 gigs of RAM and I am able to use this 2 GB model pretty well. Enough talk, let's get into the project. As Ulama server is running, you can use it to build AI based project like this one. This is a very basic python script to interact with Ulama server where we can ask questions and also the responses can be saved in a file if you want. And again, this is a very basic project. 
you can use your skill and add more stuff into it. Let me know in the comments about your ideas, I would love to see them and talk about them in the videos. And by the way, I link this script in the description. You can check that out and do your contribution if you are interested. And by the way, Ulama has list of examples with JavaScript and Python. Ulama can also be used with applications like Obsidian, which is an note-taking app. And you can install Ulama into Obsidian from community plugins and use it side by side as you need. And Ulama has lot of community integrations. I would highly recommend you to check out their GitHub.